Here's what you see when you run in the van and in person, okay? And you would think he sells this bull snot, and he goes to truck shows, and he sets up his tent, and he gets his lawn chairs out and all this stuff. He's got his little trailer, and he puts that bull snot out there. Uh, and people come up, and they buy bull snot from him. And he stands there all day in the heat, all day, all day, all day, talking about his product, talking about bull snot, explaining it to him. He's the, he owns bull snot. He owns the whole company. He's got no investors, no stockholders, nothing. It's just him. And he stands there and talks about his product and talks about it and talks about it and talks about it and tells them how he designed it, how he put the chemicals together, what he was trying to do when he did it, you know, how it works, how he thinks it's better than, you know, the competition and, and what it'll do and what it won't do. And he stands there and he talks about those cans of bull snot like it's the first time he ever fucking did it. I mean, he's got, the, he's got the energy and the love and the passion for that product of a 13 year old. I mean, he's like a seven year old in a Batman costume. That motherfucker's ready boy. And when he told me a couple weeks ago, he said, Hey, this isn't something I just started up. I started bull snot 17 years ago. I damn near fell over. I mean, with his energy and the love he's got for it, the passion he's got for it, and the energy that he puts into it. He, he's, he's like a 13-year-old kid, man. I mean, he just, he loves his company. He loves his product. He believes in it. He sells them. I mean, that's his life. That's what he does. 